Now this is my latest attempt at what the Kiwis call a Joe valve. Uh, the problem was that my pump uh, using the standard float valve would just pump forever when it got almost full as it just trickled out the last uh, few millimeters required to shut off the float valve. So I need something to stop the pump quickly and then something to start the pump quickly. So I'm hoping that this is going to do the job. Basically the float valve sits in there and it rocks up and down here. So uh, as it fills up, the water flows in, the tank fills up on the outside. Uh, this is empty or empty down to about here. Uh, and then the water flows over here, quickly shuts off the, the tank. Uh, the difficulty is letting the water out. This here is a little uh, like a float valve, I guess, but it works kind of on the inside. Made out of a nipple from a baby's bottle. Um, it uh, shuts it off when there is water inside this one, when there's pressure. And of course the float holds it up too. When it gets below a certain level, the pressure the, the float drops down a little bit, the water comes, starts to come out, uh, which means the pressure here drops, which means it should drop faster, I hope, uh, and then that will let all this water out down to whatever that level is. It just needs to go down to somewhere around here. Uh, and once it drops, then this will drop quickly, and the hopefully the water from the pump will then pump in nice and fast. This then seals off again pretty quickly. Uh, and it'll fill up to the top and it all works uh, nice. It's been not simple though. Anyhow, see whether it wants to work today.